Hello, Miraculously Awesome Squad, aka MLB Fam. Let's get into this video. So we are going to be talking about none other than Lila Rossi, which isn't probably even her real name. As we can see, she's really good at disguising herself. And so in season six, it's just going to be really interesting to see what is Lila's big secret? Because she obviously has one. I mean, she came up with this big scheming plot against Marinette specifically. And we are all just wondering, what is her deal with Marinette? It's obviously something important. Also, why the big disguise? Like, if you have nothing to hide, you wouldn't have a need to disguise yourself. But she has done multiple disguises, and I guarantee in Season 6, she probably will be having more. I mean, it looks like she's been doing this more than one time, but why? Now, a lot of people have been saying that maybe she could be Manon, but why would Manon go through all this trouble? What could have happened in her timeline of Manon's life? where she feels like she has to go back and try and cause so much trouble in this timeline. So this is going to be a very great season six to see how they tie in the backstory of why Lila is doing what she's actually doing. And also to see her with the Butterfly Miraculous. What is she going to name herself? How is she going to look in her villain state? All these questions I feel like will be answered in this season six to come also who is going to be her accomplice i'm just saying lila is not going to be able to pull this off all by herself just like hawk moth he didn't even do it all alone he had to get help even from teenage kids who were just as evil as he was in his older age so she's going to need help plotting and scheming now she already used chloe to help her plot and scheme so I feel like she won't use Chloe again in season six but that still leaves some suspects like Felix or Amelie and some people say that Marinette might be akumatized in season six I honestly feel like Marinette might come close to being akumatized but she'll never be akumatized because it'll defeat the show she's the only one that can capture Akuma so there's no way she should be able to get akumatized because that would mess all of Paris up and we wouldn't want that. Let's just say we thought that Paris had a lot with Hawk Moth on the loose. Now we're going to have a lot with Lila in her, I'm going to call it Hawk Moth state on the loose. Thank you so much for watching. Have a miraculously awesome day.